day one. Starts now. I'm up. Woke up like an hour before my alarms. Didn't even sleep that long last night, but ready to go get them. Gonna start on a few bed fish first. I'm I'm actually really excited about this one. This is one that if I could just get lucky and get a couple big bites, I think I can win this one. But that's everybody pretty much. Everybody's gonna have 12 pounds. And then if you catch a five, now you got 15 pounds. So if you catch 15 a day, you're probably gonna be you're gonna win or at least top five it. So it's really, really important that we catch a five pounder every single day or just catch three five pounders over the course of three days. Don't matter if we catch three today, two today, one tomorrow, or none today, and one tomorrow, and then two the next day. Whatever we gotta do, we need three five pounders. So I'm excited about this one. We're gonna flip all dag gum day, starting on three bed fish, and then from there we go into the stained water and we flipping them up. Y'all keep up. It's gonna be fun. Hopefully we catch like 50. And then five of them are three pounders. Let's go. Any, but might be 15. Right at it. I think he is a keeper, actually. Yeah. Things right here. shirt yeah. he was pushing the jewel whatever it was and he did say that they get hung up in the rocks a whole lot less because of the shape of the head Looks like I need to stay with Scott Martin next year on tour. Say it one more time. Oh, yeah, 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 no doubt about it. That's crazy. Got it? Non Yeah, so him and him and Tom are the only two that's. Uh
A lot of people want a lot, whole lot more than that, but that, that seems to me just fine. Right. I got it. That's a cup. That's a cup. That's a cup. Too deep? Yeah. Spotlight would help. <laughs> Put right in there. You can have that one. If you bite the end. Either way, that one's moving. Probably wouldn't even. I don't even know where you were. Right in that little bush right there with that stuff on it. Get right there. Pop out of foot. That one might call food. That's what I get. That's what I do. I think, but I'm, I'm, I got to Hey man, you splashed me. <laughs> It didn't matter, I was coming out. Can we power pole here? No.
<laughs> okay, so day one is over. Struggled a bit today. Not so much with catching keepers. We just didn't catch any big ones at all. I think my smallest fish was like a 2.4 or 2.5. And my biggest fish was probably a 2.10. So, or maybe a 2.8, 2.9. Just caught a bunch of fish, a bunch. Never got a big bite. That's how it goes. I knew that was possible. This lake is so full of two pounders. I knew for sure it was gonna be very, very important to catch some three pound or bigger fish. And that's very, very hard to do right now. So tomorrow we're gonna to swing. We're gonna go fish a bunch of new water and just see what we can come up with. Uh, it's not super easy right now, you know, to catch bigger than two and a half pounders, but hey, we ain't putting down the flipping rod all day. That's what we're doing. We throw on a flipping stick, we throw on a swim jig some and a chatterbait and that's it. Pretty much three rods. So anything other than that, we've had to dig it out of the rod box, but Actually, what happened, I was up the James River, and I thought I was about 18 or 19. Actually, I thought I was probably 16 or 17 miles away from check-in. So I was going to leave with 20 minutes left, and I figured that would give me about four minutes to pull up on one bed fish and just make like three or four casts to her and just see if she was there. So I sit down, crank up, hit it back, and I zoom out on my map, and I realize that I'm two curves up from where I thought I was. So I looked at my coin and I said, man, we're gonna be late, I'm sorry. We're gonna be late, but I was, I was going, I held it as fast as I could go. I cut every corner, I cut every hazard buoy. I ran the banks, cutting it from left to right, and we made it back. We drove 20 minutes straight and made it back at 2.15.34. At 2.15 and 34 seconds, and if at 216 I already got one pound taken away from my total so we drove like 22 miles straight got there somehow got there in 20 minutes it was rough water you know I don't know exactly how many miles it was it was probably 22 23 something like that and the water was rough it was hard to hard to keep it up close to 70 you know we had all that chop you could only go about 64 65 in it most of the way so we got there though man it was fun it, it was very relieving whenever I made it back. I can't say it was fun, but I was so beating myself up on the ride home, on the ride back because I thought I was going to be late. Anyways, day one's in the books. Probably going to be a long video because we caught a lot of fish. It was fun, though. I love catching them flipping. Flipping that bush. Donk. Just jack them, dude. It's so much fun. We're going to do a whole bunch of that tomorrow. Hopefully, pull some four-pounders out. So, stay tuned. See you on the next video if you like this. Leave a like. Leave a comment. Hit the subscribe button. Share the videos. Why not? You want your friend to see him, don't you? See y'all.